So this is a couple of weeks later after I made the video about repairing the earth contact in this Audi TT light. Uh, you can see that actually it's still in good condition. Obviously the plastic's burnt from the previous effects of the contact, but uh, the new one seems in reasonable condition. However, what I've done, I've run a separate wire, I've made a tight hole here so this sort of seals in the hole. I've soldered this to the earth bus bar inside and then I've used a much higher current uh, connector here. It's the same style as the other one as you can see, same make, but this is I think a 4.8 millimeter contact which has got a much higher uh, current rating. Now I've, I've had to put both wires in because if you don't you don't seal the backs and so you need to seal it to stop moisture getting in. So I've, I've just cut a spare length of wire which I've put into one of the crimps and uh, I could use that if, if necessary in the future but uh, pin one here I've made that the earth connection and then for the other side I'm going to use the mating half which has these crimps here and you can see they're much bigger they're double the size of the originals and you get uh, in with the kit you get these seals as well to seal the wire they're sort of a silicone rubber and uh, if you don't have the right crimp tool you'll have to carefully bend these over the conductors and solder it and then the larger ones here, they crimp around there. So this is where I've spliced it into the wiring harness in the vehicle. It's all taped and covered. And then there's the connector. And then that will just push in behind so the light can still be disconnected. All the joints are good quality and are sealed and to OEM quality. So hopefully this should be a permanent fix.